Well, the raids continue across the country in connection with the Arbo Naxal case. The police is conducting raids at the residence of Gautam Navlaka as well. Uh, he's a journalist uh, whose residence is being raided uh, as we speak. Let's quickly... All right, uh, we'll get more uh, details uh, on this from my colleague Munish Pandey, who is joining me on the phone line for more on this. Munish, bring us up to speed with the latest. Well, uh, the raids are being conducted multiple places and what we are picking up from our sources in the anti-Naxal um, square is that, from the anti-Naxal square is that uh, now the residence of Gautam Navlakha is being raided in Nehru place. Apart from Gautam Navlakha, there are multiple places across the country including Hyderabad, Pune, uh, Chhattisgarh. Uh, these places are also being raided. As of now, there is no clarity on why uh, the raids are being conducted, but what we have been given to understand by the uh, Maharashtra police is that uh, there has there is some connection between the five arrested accused in the um, um, in the case where it emerged that there was a plan to assassinate uh, Prime Minister Narendra Modi, and that is why um, working on those connections now police has got some links, and that is why these raids have taken place. It's a coordinated raid where multiple um, um, uh, police teams are working as we speak and uh, these uh, raids are being conducted uh, in uh, Delhi as well as in Hyderabad and other places in other states. Back to you. All those uh, details. Uh, in fact, uh, Munish, before I let you go, uh, now there are lawyers and journalists, those who have been uh, in fact, targeted in these raids, there are many those who are saying that this is also an intimidation tactic. Most of the lawyers, those who have been raided, are the ones those who are representing the accused in this case. Yeah, well, uh, this is very shocking because uh, these are the lawyers and uh, even the activists uh, who are very prominent. And uh, till date, no one even heard about such things um, about these people. But now police say that they have got some connection and uh, that is why these raids are uh, taking place. And when we speak to, when we spoke to few of the state police, even they are not aware of that what is, what is the exact connection. But uh, even the Pune police as well as the Maharashtra police, who is uh, probing this case, they are very tight-lipped about this. They are saying that they will seek the transit remand of these people uh, after conducting the, these raids. And once the transit remand, um, they get the transit remand, they will be arrested and then only they will disclose that what exactly are the allegations and what they have got against these activists and the lawyers and the journalists in this case. Thank you so much for joining us with all those uh, details. In fact, we will come back to you for more on this story, Munish. Thanks for watching the video. For more such news and updates, please like, share and subscribe to India Today. Also check out our other great videos from our channel. We know you would love to.